Welcome to DOJ Online Appointment Booking Demonstration. In this video we will walk you through how you can book an online appointment as an individual or company representative. To go through the booking process, you would need to be registered with your account details and gone through the registration process. What you see here is the login screen, and because you have successfully registered you will be able to enter your login details. Enter your email address or username and your password that you registered with to log in to the DOJ online services. Once the details are captured, please click on the login button. This will take you to the DOJ online services landing page. On this page on the left hand side, you will notice menu items. To expand click on the arrow facing down on appointment booking. Click on Appointment Booking and that will take you to Online Appointment Booking page. Please select Individual if you want to make an appointment as an individual user. Or, please select Company slash Entity Representative as a Company or Entity Representative. Please select Make a New Appointment to make a new appointment, easily click on Clear to clear the information captured, or easily click on next to continue with the appointment booking. You will then be directed to the complete individual information screen where all your individual information that was created during the registration process has been auto-populated into the appropriate fields for your convenience. Please capture any information that is not auto-populated to proceed with the appointment booking. To clear, Easily click on the clear button to clear all the information that has been captured or easily click on the previous button to navigate back to the previous screen. To proceed with the appointment booking, please click on the next button. You will then be directed to the appointment booking information landing page where you need to capture the appointment booking related information. Please select the service type. Please select the appointment type. Please select the reference number which would normally be associated with your case that was registered, otherwise known as your unique reference number, URN. Next select the province in which you would like to make an appointment in, and then select the applicable master's office which is filtered based on the province that was selected. Select the date on which you want to make an appointment, the available time slots for that date, and the master's office selected will then be displayed. Please select the suited available time slot. To clear, easily click on the clear button to clear all the information that was captured, or easily click on the previous button to navigate back to the previous screen. To proceed with the appointment booking, please click on the Submit button. You will then be directed to the Checklist Documents pop-up, where you can see the required documents for your appointment booking. You can preview the documents or download the documents. Once the documents have been previewed or downloaded, you can click on OK to submit the appointment. A confirmation notification will be displayed with your appointment booking reference number, Please note the reference number. Easily click on the Continue button to proceed. A notification pop-up will then be displayed indicating your appointment details for the appointment booking that has been made. Click on OK button to proceed. You will also receive an email notification from the DOJ online services with the appointment details. In addition, you will also receive an email invitation with the date and time that has been scheduled. You do not have to accept this invitation, however, you will receive an email notification from the master office when they accept your booking. We have covered the process of making a new appointment. Now you will see how to amend an existing appointment. To amend an existing appointment, Easily select the checkbox for an individual if you have already made an appointment as an individual user. Or, please select company or entity representative if you have already made an appointment as a company or entity representative. Please select amend an appointment to amend an appointment. 
Easily click on the clear button to clear the information that has been captured. Alternatively click on the next button to proceed with amending your appointment. You are then directed to the amend appointment booking screen where you can search for the appointment using an ID number or passport number or a reference number. I will select a reference number, then you need to enter your reference number here. Easily click on the clear button to clear the information that has been captured. Alternatively click on the search button to search for your reference number. Your appointment booking details will then be displayed based on the reference number that was searched upon. Please click on the hyperlink of the reference number in the table displayed to amend the appointment booking. Upon clicking on the reference number hyperlink, you will then be redirected to the appointment booking information screen where you can amend the details of the appointment. Please continue amending the details of the appointment. Easily click on the clear button to clear the information that has been captured. Alternatively click on the submit button to continue with the amendment of your booking. Once you click on the submit button you then be redirected to the checklist documents screen where you can preview or download the checklist documents. Once the documents have been previewed or downloaded, easily click on the OK button to proceed. Your appointment booking reference number will then be displayed. Please click on the Continue button to proceed. A further confirmation will be displayed reflecting your appointment details have been updated. Please click on OK to continue. You will also receive an email notification with the updated details. You do not have to accept this invitation. However, you will receive an email notification from the master office when they accept your amended booking. Now we will proceed with how to cancel an existing appointment. If you want to cancel an appointment that was created as an individual user, please select individual checkbox. Please select company or entity representative if you want to cancel an appointment that was created at a company or an entity representative. Easily select cancel an appointment. Easily click on the clear button to clear the information that you have captured. Alternatively click on the next button to continue with cancelling your appointment. You will then be redirected to the cancel appointment booking screen where you can search for an appointment by using the ID number slash passport number or your booking reference number. Enter your reference number if you searched using the reference number of enter the ID number slash passport number. Easily click on the clear button to clear the information that has been captured. Alternatively select the search button to view the appointment information based on the search criteria value. Then click on the booking reference number hyperlink to continue with the cancellation of the appointment. A confirmation will appear asking if you are sure you want to cancel the appointment booking with the reference number selected. Easily click on no if you have changed your mind on cancelling your appointment. Alternatively click on yes if you want to continue with the cancellation of your appointment. An alert notification will then be displayed with confirmation that your booking has successfully been cancelled. In addition, you will also receive an email notification indicating that you have cancelled your appointment with the appointment details. This brings us to the end of this demonstration, where you have learned how to book an appointment as an individual user or company slash entity representative.